the Elwena deposit in the uh, uh, Congo, we have the Kundalini citrine quartz, lovely dark rich honey yellow quartz, uh, dark champagne even. Um, so champagne is usually a little bit lighter. And uh, what we have in these is often a little, a little uh, uh, internal fractures which cause this rainbow effect as you can see over here. Let's first of all have a look at the whole crystal, quite a large crystal, a uh, single crystal, contact running down the edge here, going up to that corner, furthermore pretty perfect, termination, slight nick on the termination, lovely color though and absolutely natural citrines. I think the uh, reason for my selection here is that there's a hell of a lot of, it's almost like there are little lights inside the sky. And uh, uh, one of the ways of, of seeing the difference between the baked amethyst and the real citrine would be the clarity uh, you have in these crystals. There's not the broken glass effect as you often have with a baked amethyst. All the way from the Elwena deposit. Nice size, nice deep rich color. And uh, pretty, pretty good quality. Often these uh, uh, citrines are a little bit damaged. Oh, look, there's some little babies sitting on that edge over there. So the, the big one is, is as they'd say, you are not alone. <laughs> All the way from the, uh, the, the Congo, Kundalini citrine quartz. Also another phenomenon, now when I see this particular angle, um, when we look into these guys, there's almost a, 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 a ghosty effect of different shades of color. And in some of them, almost a gray going into a, a sort of a bluishness. But that might be what, what I'm seeing.